Podcast Lawyer. Today we're doing a Let's Play Tracks the Train Set game in VR using the Unreal Engine VR Injector by Preydog. Tracks, as you probably know, does not have VR, does not have official VR support. It released back in 2019 and it is an Unreal Engine 4.2 game. And because of that, it works with the UE VR injector by Prey Dog. And that's what I'm doing. I tried it out. It works perfectly in my opinion. Well, not perfectly, almost perfectly. There's a few minor visual issues, which we'll get into. But let's go ahead and let's play. I am using the MetaQuest 3 using Link Cable on an RTX 3080. And I'm using an Xbox One gamepad. Now, if you look at the options, I have the graphics set to beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, I have resolution scale to 100%. And I have motion blur off. And 1920 by 1080 resolution. I do have V-Sync on. Basically, my headset's running at 72 frames per second, though. So... It's only, I believe, the Oculus mirrored view that's running at 60 frames per second. Or, so it, since that's the YouTube recording anyway, it doesn't make any difference there. Uh, anyways, this is, in case you don't know, train, the track set game is, in, is a sandbox toy train set game. So basically, if you ever had a train set, you know, as a child or as a, a child at heart, an adult with a child at heart. Uh, you know, this is basically a toy train set track game where you can just lay out the track set of your dreams, your train track set of your dreams. There are so many options, so many different pieces to play with, you know, lots of stuff. And uh, versus trying to build one on my own and trying to do a video of it, I'm mostly going to be playing um, somebody else's. So... Let's go ahead and let's click load and we're going to play somebody else's, not mine. I have this. I might show this later, but I'm going to show what somebody else has, which is the roller coaster. We're going to load that. Okay. And uh, there we go. And uh, we can get on our train. What we're going to do, though, is we're going to we're going to change the backdrop from plain. Uh, what do we want? Overcast? Sunset? Evening? I like the stars. And the floor, uh, what do we want? Stone? Water? Sand? Hay? Let's, let's stick with... Let's stick with snow. Okay. And... We're, we're going to stick with that for, for right now. Uh... Well, the train though we're gonna we're gonna change it to to gingerbread for right now gingerbread and the bell yeah so let, let's just keep it at that let's get inside uh and you notice we got our little little you can go forward it can go backward and you can also change tracks that's what the the other lever is for so if we wanted to change tracks, we can do that. We're not going to do that right now. We're just going to go as fast as possible. Now, by default, on this train, I'm a little bit too low. Like, this is the normal view. I actually have to lift my head up. And if you notice, there's a little bit of blur. There's a little bit of blur in the distance. I don't know how to turn that off. I don't, I'm not sure if there's an in-game setting to to have it uh, not be blurry at a distance. If anyone knows, if you could write a comment on my video letting me know how to how to make that better. Uh, I don't know if there's an in-game setting for that. I, I don't believe I saw anything related to that in the in-game settings. By the way, there's different views. So this is uh, a little bit back. And this is a little bit forward. And as you can see, this is the roller coaster. 
it's a, it, 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 it's pretty fun. And obviously you can add so much to this. And I actually, I, I think I made a mistake. I actually have gone for a different example. One where there's passengers. Uh, but I think this is good because it showed some of the options. You know, this is like, I guess, a happy accident, but not quite what I wanted to show. I actually wanted to show picking up passengers and dropping them off. But this is just an example of something you can build. This I don't think this is one of the more difficult ones you can build. <laughs> and obviously, you can build one with obstacles in the way and you can knock them off. There we go. And, you know, <laughs> we missed the train crash and we missed the best part. Okay. Uh, well, that's fine. We're, what, what we're going to do now is we're going to load a different scene. And like I said, what we want to do... I think we want to do the modern apartment. We want to do that one. I, I Load anyways, yes. Okay, there we go. No. Oh, yes. No. I don't know what's going on. Uh, it, it loaded the same, the same. I'm not sure what's going on. Load. Is this a bug? What's going on? Clear track. Uh, level select. Okay, um, so load. This should be in the apartment. There we go, we finally got it, okay. There we go. Uh, I'm not sure what was going on, it might have been a bug. But what we want to do is we want to pick up the passengers. But before we pick up any passengers, we're just going to do a drive-by. And I'm not sure how the cursor got in here, but we want to get the cursor out of the way. And for just to start, we want to... Now, we, we want to change a couple of things. Uh, I want to change the... Yeah. Okay, there, there we go. Um, I don't know that we want to change... Well, I think maybe the floor... There we go. Um, let's just go. And again, we're just going to go full speed. And like I said, you can go full speed. And this is to change the track. We're not going to do that. We're just going to go straight through it. And obviously, we're, there's some dangers here. And there's so many different toys to play with and stuff to add to really make this your own sandbox in these different environments. There's just so many different combinations you can go for. Um, and like I said, different views, we're gonna look at the different views. Just so, this is a very relaxing, cozy game to play. And it's so easy to build and there's so many different track parts you know so many different little toys you can add and if you look at the store page video you'll see examples of what people have done with this and it's just crazy what people have done uh, obviously it, it does take some some patience because it you know building something intricate takes a lot of time i will say this game makes it very easy to build though so you know it's just very relaxing to build this game because they, they make it very easy but you know obviously if you want to build something really good it takes a lot of planning. It takes a lot of time. It takes a lot of effort. <laughs> Qualities that I usually don't have. 
<laughs> but uh, yeah, I think this is my 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 main complaint is I noticed a couple of things, a couple of visual glitches. So the first thing I've already mentioned that it does get blurry in the distance. I don't know if there's any way to fix that either from in-game settings or, or somewhere else. I think UEVR might be able to fix it, but I didn't see any in-game settings to fix it. So just FYI, I don't know if there's a way to fix it. Now, obviously, it's not the worst, you know, because it is blurry, but you can still see it. You know, I wish it was clear all the way, you know, from a distance, but we all know that you know obviously it can be quite taxing on a computer so it would make sense why it would be blurry at a distance to to minimize the the load on your computer obviously and obviously we're crashing into stuff and now now we're getting back well we're not getting back on the tracks okay but we can restart Re reset there we go and we're, we're going to start now and we're, we're, we're going to go and we're going to try to get the passengers on board, which is going to take a little bit of, of, uh, of thought. It's, n you know, it's not automatic, but we're going to do that. We're going to, or at least try to <laughs> keep in mind. I haven't played this game for very long, so hope, well, no, we want to get a little bit more forward. Now we obviously want to put a, we might have gone too forward. Let's go a little bit back. I think that's perfect. And we want to leave right here. Okay. And we want to go to our train. Okay. And we want to build. So we want to go to the venue. Now, I want to show you all the different things that you can do. Look at look at this. Small house, medium house, tall house, a random barbershop. You know, you can put a barbershop somewhere here. I'm sure we can put one somewhere. Uh, and by the way, you can have it floating in the air, so you don't need to put it on, on the ground, just depending on the settings that, that you put. And uh, you can uh, put it, so we're going to try to put it right here, but what we're going to do is we're going we're gonna to twist it, and we're going to set it there. There we go. Now we got a barbershop there. Okay, pretty cool, huh? Uh, but like I said, there's a whole lot of stuff. Flower shop, toy shop, bakery, green girls, you know, some watermill, post op, pub, bungalow, man. Look, look at all this toys, windmill. Air traffic control, gas automer cage. I don't, I'm not even sure. I don't even know what that is. Gas automer tank, aircraft hangar, radio, wind turbine, lighthouse, hospital, fires. Look at all Ferris wheel. We need to put a Ferris wheel somewhere. Okay. Oh, can we? Is that is that gonna work? Let let's 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 see. Oh no. Okay, there we go. <laughs> we'll, we'll see how that works. Uh, okay, let's keep going. Uh, we're not going to... Oh, we want to put a lamppost somewhere. We have to put a lamppost here. Come on. Let people know that there's a... No, we, we don't, we don't want to do that. Okay. Just one lamppost. Okay. <laughs> There's so much stuff here. Trees, a bush arch, bush, bush arch. We want to be careful because we don't want this to interfere. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, we're, we're, we're getting crazy here. We're, we're, we're going crazy. Oh, a platform. Okay, so we're going to put a platform because that's what we need to, to put the passengers in here. Is that where we want to be? I think so, right? Right? Is it here or here? Here or here or here? I think we want to be... We want to be here with our platform. Okay. Okay, there we go. And that and they're gonna go inside the train, right? Come on, all aboard. All aboard. <laughs> we got the passengers, so we gotta go backwards though. We gotta go backwards. Cause I wanna see all this. I wanna see everything that we did here. <laughs> uh, how do we put the light on though? 
How do we put the light on? We're going to go forward and look at the barber shop. <laughs> oh, this is this is so wonderful. We're just going to go. We're, we're going to go. Okay, okay. We're, we're, we're safe. We're safe. <laughs> oh, man. This game is so relaxing. So cozy. You know, it's just so easy. It's just so easy to build. So it's super relaxing. It's not complicated. And it's just fun. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Wait. No. Hey, train. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Train. Train, train, train. You, you missed. You missed the stop, dude. You missed the stop. You missed the stop. Okay. <laughs> no big deal. No big deal. We, we, we got this. We got this. We missed the stop, but we're, we're, we're going to make it. We can go in reverse. We're the only train, so we don't have to worry. No collisions. No, no, no trains. No deaths. No, no delays. We're going to stop. And we're going to drop off the, the passengers. They made it to the station. Can, can we do this? Uh, we're gonna turn here. We're gonna turn here. Nope. 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 So we're gonna turn. We didn't try to get back to the station, but we need to turn. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna navigate this. So we have we have to turn here. There we go. And there we go. We got it. There we go. There we go. We got this. <laughs> and again, we're going to change views. And we're, we're going to change views. Sorry. That's what I wanted to do right here. A little overhead view. Nice. That's nice. And we're going to go to the top. All right. <laughs> Can we get back to the start point? Okay. Are we just going back and forth? Or are we going somewhere? You know what? I think we may, we need to make a turn somewhere. Hold on. What's going on? How do we... Yeah, we're just going back and forth. So how do we actually go somewhere? Yeah, we need to make a turn somewhere. We're, we're just going in circles. So we're, we're going to have to figure this out somehow. So let's see what we can do. How do we how do we end this loop here? OK, so we're going to have to do something here. How do we how do we get out of this mess here? How do we switch tracks? Where do we switch tracks? Gotta, we gotta be vigilant here. Oh, I think we're 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 out of it. We're out of the loop. The loop. I think we're out of it. Okay. No, we're 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 back to square one. <laughs> I mean, we're going in different directions, but we're, we're not going back to the to the place where we need to go, though. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna turn here. Okay, let's see where we where we end up. How do we navigate around this? This is a maze. I'm gonna have to go a little bit slower so I can make the proper. We're gonna have to turn here, right? No, we can't turn here. How do we need to make an adjustment somewhere? Yeah. How do we do this? We have to make an adjustment somewhere, but I don't see very many places where we can change tracks.
Yeah, I still don't see a way to. Yeah, we're 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 just going in circles. This is quite the complicated one. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna do something different to get to a different point. We're, we're gonna slow down. We're we're gonna go over here. Okay, we're gonna slow down. Okay, all right, we're going in a different direction now. Good. We're going slower because we don't know exactly how this is going to end up. Where are the passengers? I don't like that it's blurry though. I can, you know, it, it, it is distracting. We're going to go faster here because I don't see a point in going slow here. But then we're going to slow down. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Blank. Oh, wow, we made it. I thought we were for sure we're gonna die there, but we made it to the tracks. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, wait. Oh wait. I think we can make it all the way over there. Yeah, I think we can. Even though there's no tracks, I think we can make it. Oh no, nope, 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 we can't. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Uh let me show let me show something else. So clear track. Okay, so we're gonna do load. We're gonna do the one, this is one that I tried to make. So it, this is not very good, because I, again, well, I don't know what's going on. Level select, apart, I think it was this one. Okay, yeah. So I don't have a whole lot of time. I don't want to spend a lot of time, but this is what I was building just to show you guys. And it took me about 22 minutes to build it. So it doesn't seem like a whole lot. You know, it's not impressive at all, but it just tells you, you know, that it does take time to build anything of, of quality. So here, here we go. This is the one that I built. Okay. <laughs> it's not impressive at all, but you know, I'm happy with the results. You know, and with more time, I can definitely build something better, but uh, you know, this is what I came up with. It's pretty cool, I think. It has a nice little Christmas vibe to it and it's going all over the apartment I, I think i wanted to go around the christmas tree i and i think you're gonna see that in a little bit yeah you're gonna see it next right here okay there we go <laughs> uh um, I don't know how I got this game. I think I got it in a bundle, if I'm not mistaken. I don't think I bought this game, you know, by itself. I think I bought it in a game bundle. Where? Which game bundle? I don't know. It might have been a Humble Bundle. might have been Fanatical. Might, who knows where I got this game from? I, I know I bought it. I just don't know how. I know I didn't get it free. Um, but this would be one of the best toy train track games in VR. Now, I know some people are going to say Derail Valley, but keep in mind, that's not really a toy train track. That's like a more like a train simulator, which it's very good. It's, it's one of the best, if not the best, train experience in VR, bar none. But, you know, for a little toy track game that's just super simple to, to build and super simple to get into and just drive, I, this is one of the... One of the better ones in VR, and that's thanks to the Unreal Engine VR Injector. Anyways, I just wanted to show it off. Uh, I'm not going to show the building because, you know, it, it, it would... Well, maybe I can add a little... In fact, let me... Let me just add something really quick before I end this video because I do want to show it, show it off. <laughs> so let me... Let me get off the train. Okay. And let's build something real simple. So we're going to build uh 
I guess we're gonna have to build it over here. There we go. And so it's easy to, to make elevations, but we're gonna we're gonna go under first before we do any elevations. So he, here's basically where it, and I think here's where we wanted to elevate. So to elevate, we just go up, up, and I don't know that we, no, we don't want it to go up again. But you see here, now we got different elevated. Do we want to go up or down? I think we want to go down. Actually. There we go. So there we go. <laughs> Just real quick. So let, let me get it on the train real quick. And let's go a little bit on reverse and let's take the different uh, track. So again, we hold it like this. And obviously we go forward. We're going to take the different train track because we're, we're switching to it. There we go. And just real quick, get on it. <laughs> Very cool, huh? Very simple to add on. And obviously we could put different decorations and stuff, which... I'm not going to show that because I I don't think you need to see. I mean, I've already added some on the other. So oh, pretty cool, right? I like it. <laughs> and you can also just sit back and, you know, watch from here and, and enjoy the the show from here. Uh, while you, you know, let's actually let's let's do one thing. Let's add a tree. Let's add a tree. There we go. There we go. Pretty cool, huh? Very easy to add stuff. Very cool to see. Like I said, this is a cozy, relaxing game where it's just easy to build. And then you can get on your train track set and just, just enjoy it. And enjoy the different views. So I highly recommend this. Thank you to Prey Dog for this amazing Unreal Engine VR injector. His whole team. Thank you so much. You've brought so much joy to PC VR. You know... A lot of people think that PC VR is dying, and, and maybe it's true, but UE VR has brought so much life back to PC VR, and now PC VR is the place to go. There are so many cool VR experiences now in PC VR, but you do need to use this injector in, in order to enjoy them. Anyways, I'm Fast Lawyer. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you found it useful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, have a wonderful day. Goodbye.